What's up, what's up, what's up, Cook and Climb lovers? We're back in Cook and Climb headquarters, and today my arm's feeling a bit like spaghetti. But not like spaghetti, my arm's feeling like muffaldina, and that's the pasta we're cooking today. And my arm's feeling like that because I had some goes, well, trying the moves on one of the 9A's in Arco. It's the underground. What's happening? The problem right now. Ah, there is a knot in the rope! Professionals! Well, I've done three moves! Well, Jeff! It's hard. You can see after we cook the pasta. So, muffaldina is this flat, long, curly-edged pasta, which I really liked when I was a kid. So, let's see how it goes with prawns, pepper, some chili, garlic, saffron, and some white wine. That should be good. First thing you need to do is to cook the prawns. White wine goes in. Oh, this is so big, like, I can barely touch the end. Yeah, that's where it's hard. While the prawns are chilling outside the window, let's make the rest of the sauce. Yep, yep, that's pretty standard now. Then we put in some salt, some chili flakes, not a lot, just a wee bit. And some fresh pepper. Whilst our sauce is cooking, reducing a little bit, getting the pepper soft, we'll cook pasta and then peel the prawns. One, two. Get a drum as a toy for Christmas. One, two. We are one of the greatest oh. innovators. Make the no to and right. How are we The water is bubbling, now it's time to submerge our pasta. Time to get dirty. 
to peel your prawn. Twist the head off with all the intestines, then separate the body from the shell. Hold it by the tail and uh, voila, I failed. Oh yeah, that means that the pasta is ready. The holes are good to recover, but I cannot do the moves from which I need to recover. <laughs> Come on. Such power. Come on. Tension. Come on. Come on. Dang! Put your pasta in the sauce. Smash in the presentation here. Whilst I'm waiting for my favorite food critic, um, I'll have some water. And uh, yeah, I think this pasta was a bit of a struggle, especially with peeling the prawns and portioning it. While underground was even a bigger struggle. Okay, get me down. Okay, my favorite Italian, give me the verdict. The pasta is a wee bit cold because my wife was putting our newborn baby to sleep and I didn't want to be rude and eat without her. Sometimes I do though. The audience still waiting for the verdict. I need to eat everything first. In a scale from one to prawn. Four. It's super tasty, very spicy. And very, very, very tasty. It's just that the, 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 this pasta is not my favorite. So, we got very, 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 very subjective rating here. <laughs> um, I cannot give five to all the pasta, which is good, otherwise, it would be a lot of five. Yeah, true. Then there is no best. Um, for me, I would say. The, te the texture is pretty dang good, but I would like it with more creamy, cheesy sauce. And um, the sauce itself, totally a five. Mm -hmm. But the pasta with this sauce is probably a four. I struggled, but I flashed this pasta. Five out of 190. Tick. Oh, hello, Zeus. Do you smell the seafood? Yes, yes. I would like. Give me some. Give me some prawns. Give me. Give me all of them. All of the prawns. Pasta you can keep. Just the prawns. Just the prawns. No. 